cool now that summer is here and the daily afternoon rain showers are beginning. That means puddles, a potential breeding ground for mosquitoes. But what if you don't want harsh chemicals on your kids? Is there another way to keep the pests away? Eight on your side has answers today. Joining me now is Erica Walters Thompson with Tampa Bay Parenting, and you have Imani along here. Welcome, I do. Imani. I love when we have special guests in the studio. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. We're talking about kind of non-traditional bug repellents, not Correct. the stuff that you get in most of the drugstores, but other options. Are you seeing yourself on TV? That's right. Hello. See, you're beautiful, uh -huh. aren't you? Say thank you. Who's That's your friend? Quickly, who's your little friend? Your little kitty? She's being Is that shy. kitty? Yes. Okay, so I smell this. So essential oil, oils maybe a safer option for the kiddos? They are. Essential oils are amazing. They are the little oil sacks that you find in plants. So in the leaves, the stems, the barks, the flowers of the plant. And it's actually the plant's natural protection. Mm. So if it can protect the plant, then it can protect us without the harmful chemicals. Is there a certain combo? Because I see a lot of essential oils here. There is. This is our Terra Shield, which is our bug repellent blend. And it actually comes in a nice little spray bottle so okay. we can you want me to spray it on you yeah super Feels safe for the kids they just oh. rub it in one thing with essential oils is that you do have to apply more often than the standard chemicals okay that's because good it's know. super clean there are no harsh chemicals it's straight plants it'll How does last it smell it smells what does it smell like it kind of smells like chocolate doesn't it? It does smell a little yeah, bit. Yeah, like so you chocolate. can smell like chocolate and be protected from all the bugs. And it keeps them away. It, it works. does. It's pretty amazing. So we have most of these oils here are in the blend here. Peppermint oil is great for spiders. If you get a bite, you can put some oils on and it kind of helps to take care of that right away. Well, so. and you know, with all the concerns over the Zika virus and mosquito bites and other things mosquitoes carry, this is good news. Absolutely. Just a minute and I will. It and I'm, I'm guessing you can Google to find the combination or, or find You can. Oils. So the Terra Shield is straight, ready to rock and roll, or you can make your own. We have people do that, too, with a little bit of the fractionated coconut oil. You can take a little hand cream and mm. put the oils in that and then rub it all over your body because mm. you want that carrier oil Got for it. the essential oils. Good um, stuff, Erica. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're and very thank welcome. you, Imani. I think she's putting it on her legs. <laughs> she totally is. You're wondering. She's adorable. Thank, <laughs> thank you very you. much. Coming up,